back to channel I was absolutely fine so it is super chilly but uh, the sun is kind of helping us to uh, be warm and uh, today I will be just giving you a sort of a tour of Zostel because uh, by afternoon we would be leaving this place and traveling back home so this would be a kind of uh, the second last vlog as I can say because we are not sure whether I will be traveling to another halt place from where we would be uh, probably boarding our flight from uh, which is Delhi so before I start with the entire vlog uh, as I said yesterday uh, like I will be uh, giving you kind of a tour of Zostel as well but before I do that I'll just quickly give you a quick time lapse about uh, how quickly you can pack or how uh, messy the entire thing was and how quickly uh, you would I, I, I still have to kind of uh, pack all the things so I'll be just uh, packing the entire bag because I am just literally carrying one trekking bag because I don't want to like carry too much luggage or too many bags as such so let's just quickly pack up and then I'll show you how uh, the entire Zostel is around so let's start with the video all right so Zostel Dalhousie is one of the second best uh, Zostel which I would say and literally it was snow when we were kind of there exactly at this place which was uh, an amazing amazing thing uh, so that upper road kind of leaves you towards the entrance and this is the kind of the main area from which uh, you would be kind of entering uh, inside uh, the common area as well as uh, the reception so on the left side you can see the reception and these are all uh, the common area where uh, you can play business you can uh, even try out uh, some Jenga there is a guitar lying around there are bean bags and uh, this entire vibe itself uh, looking at uh, the like a slopey uh, kind of uh, rooftop it, it is specifically because of the snow we can play carom and this is the kind of the main uh, chilling area where, uh, last, where last night we definitely even had uh, some um, bonfire and that is the main road as you can see and an amazing amazing uh, balcony along with this exterior uh, kind of texture which gives you a kind of a exterior dining experience and those were the amazing uh, mighty Himalayas at the very uh, left side uh, but at the same time it was entirely covered in snow and it was uh, it was absolutely worth it because it was kind of uh, totally covered in snow uh, then we as uh, head uh, towards our dorms our uh, dorms are kind of situated or even the rest of the rooms are kind of situated a little uh, at the base uh, so that was kind of the upper part so in all the places where you're traveling in the north uh, it roads actually start then they kind of make you <laughs> walk through uh, the below floor and the floors are kind of descending so it is the upper floor then there is a minus one floor then there is minus two floor so at minus one floor there was that reception this is the minus two floor where all the basic rooms are there and uh, from here this corridor would be uh, directly guiding you through uh, guiding you through towards all the main rooms uh, where we were kind of staying in to the mixed bed dorms but because there was there were literally nobody at that dorms we kind of got the entire dorms to ourselves and this was again an amazing chilling common area where you can watch uh, movies you can read books and this specific room was also dedicated for people who were doing vacations like us and uh, where literally you can plant your laptops connect chargers and this was the amazing uh, wall art of friends uh, definitely no comments on that but this specifically was our dorm with all uh, the bunk beds and it is of course an amazing experience uh, having uh, to stay having your own lockers and uh, post that oh, i had to uh, pack very soon so this is the kind of 
of the time lapse video of me just packing as soon as possible because we had to check out although uh, the uh, like, like the rest of the day we are supposed to be uh, spending at the main area itself and as soon as you get outside the dorm this was the amazing experience uh, because the rest of the day we were kind of working but of course we had to check out early uh, so that the other people could um, have uh, their rooms for themselves and um, literally i kind of got an amazing feeling because there were very less people who were kind of staying at that time in the specific hostel that made the experience even more serene because the more crowd there would be you are not getting that peace of mind and this uh, snow and this specific hostel uh, was kind of a full fledged package where we got to see uh, the snow as well as we got to work at our own leisure time and on top of that uh, this specific uh, snowfall and the amazing vibe of Zostel I could definitely say that after Jaisalmer this is one of the most favorite Zostel which I had ever stayed at Alright, so that is it for the entire hostel tour, and this is indeed one of the sec uh, like the second best hostel which I've ever stayed into. First, of course, it is Jaisalmer, uh, but you can see this snow, and imagine how it would be when it is actually uh, when there is actual snowfall. It's so getting paid while you are traveling, and also while you have a kind of a full-time job uh, is something which I have always dreamt about. So as I said, I've been working throughout uh, the time because it is the remote work, and because I can I have that access of working from home for my full-time job. Uh, but travel core as well as uh, travel travel with Buketo uh, is kind of the collaboration which I have made on this tour. Uh, the, the overall uh, thought process based on how I am currently traveling by managing my full time job and by uh, collaborating with these partners. And now uh, we'll be just uh, having some breakfast and um, I, I'm not sure uh, I will be able to uh, directly vlog in between because I still have work to do or probably I'll directly meet you um, at the next place which we are kind of halting at. So let's go. <laughs> Hey guys, so that is it for this particular vlog. I'm not sure whether most probably in the second, uh, in the last part, I would be shooting it or not because uh, I'm be direct now towards the bus stop where uh, we'll be directly boarding our train towards Delhi. And with then Delhi, say, uh, we'll be traveling further towards Mumbai. <laughs> Hopefully, this time we will not uh, miss our flight. But just look at this last, last, last sight of the snow and also, also I'm not feeling that cold now because it is kind of I've kind of become homesick of Mumbai that I want to travel back to but uh, definitely going to miss this amazing amazing view and uh, especially this specific hostel uh, which is kind of not that much uh, it is definitely an underrated one that I, that I can say because I've stayed at uh, McLaurin's now I've stayed at uh, Jodhpur as well as Jaisalmer but this is this definitely deserves some more crowd uh, but uh, most probably tomorrow by 9 or 10 uh, uh, we should be reaching back towards Delhi and from Delhi we'll be uh, booking a flight further towards uh, mostly Mumbai and tomorrow also I would be working from the probably uh, on the way or on the go so probably after this we will be directly heading uh, towards the bus stop now and from there uh, we'll be taking our bus which would be back uh, towards uh, Mumbai so I'm really really thankful if you're still watching until here and if you have seen all the rest of the episodes as well uh, please 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 subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed yet and I'll be meeting you in the next video until then keep traveling and keep traveling safely